My name is Jayanta, Jayanta Das. So I have been working uh, as a product manager uh, last around seven to eight years and I'm an MBA graduate and I did my uh, um, product management certification from Acradian. So current uh, current role is what I am just uh, leading to one of the um, product uh, uh, management for the digital manufacturing marketplace for NetSeal. So it is an uh, in-house project. So I have recently uh, joined in this company to take care of the entire uh, uh, development of digital manufacturing marketplace. First thing I could say the biggest challenge is what uh, when I'm going to switch or uh, switching like okay to the next uh, moment as a product manager, uh, the first thing is what to dealing with the stakeholder management and uh, to meet the deadlines as um, of the problem solutions like okay we have to find the problems and uh, how you're going to bring out the solutions for that problem statement the four things and also how you're going to communicate to the stakeholders that is a major sense like okay if, as a product manager so you need to take care of that particular activities so when you're going to work as a product managers so you need to understand as a, like as as a, like you know customer point of views uh, as a user perspective so that is a major challenge like we should face uh, as in project product management i could say uh, when i started my career with dubai with landmark.com i see uh, because i am working as in particular in the e-commerce background and uh, and connect to the multiple uh, customers in the back end uh, then providing how you like how they are uh, behaving to us to our portal it's like how we're going to give the solutions it's all about okay i work like the customer success team then it makes much more interesting like okay, when you're giving you know it's a it's a customer solution perspective uh, when you work on the problem statement and giving the solutions uh, that makes much more interesting as a product management activities for example if you have a uh, uh, both the knowledge for uh, technical as well as functional part it could make much more easy to you uh, to to enhance some um, enhancement of the particular product ideas creating an entire the product roadmap so that should be you know, makes me like you know, uh, to uh, make as a product managers easily uh, to make it much more helpful for me that to be as product manager from beginning to career stage so i join as career as i work as finance prospective then i understand about what is the like okay what is, what is the role and responsibility as a product manager then i understand that particular activities then i took like some kind of courses i understand the like okay deep dive level of uh, uh, as a product management like from the ba perspective then how you bring out all this kind of uh, you can say uh, key objective and the key task the how you're going to dealing with this like now with all the situation what are the key blockers so that makes much more helpful for to as a product management in my current interviews with the hcl it's very modest very simple uh, predominantly uh, you can say the interviewers uh, uh, the technical as well as around is totally very simple okay they took very smoothly process so first initially uh, i think for the single we have one single openings they might have taken around uh, 200 approximately uh, the resume they have screened out so i could say in the screening uh, our uh, resume has to be particularly in the like you know, key components has to be mentioned over there so then it will easily easily like okay to take over that particular resume to their activities and then HR has called me like immediately they say like okay your resume is totally perfectly matching to my our experience because they are doing some kind of marketplace new project creations like for the marketplace activities and then uh, they advised to me uh, how, how you would like to be a part of this our project as well I said without like you know kind of hesitations I guess it's perfectly fine for me then uh, I think like they might have uh, gone through like to around 20 to 25 uh, kind of technical round of interviews like a uh, candidate to take the interviews and then found suitable to my like you know my experience so in first initial like okay the HR has asked like taking taking the initial screening of your like what exactly our experience and uh, they will ask you about like your roles and responsibility when you do can you join and thirdly uh, once done everything then they will move to directly to the hiring manager 
the hiring manager there, there are like two to three round of technical round of interviews happened in the single stage uh, they had two like you know hiring manager was sitting over there and they asked so many questions like okay about uh, your uh, case studies about the current role and responsibilities and then uh, they have given some kind of uh, not assignment like okay you have to give the problem statement how you're going to um, give the solution to them that makes much more sense like if you are being capable like how you are going to make in yeah, providing solution to them then then that that will make much more helpful to them like as a hiring manager to select you so they it is gone around one and a half hours uh, so they found like okay it is good that then then they directly told in that point of time we are moving to directly in the like now uh, next round uh, who should be more into domain export so they can take like now final round of discussion like of an abuse that is happened and final round it happened within a week itself not in a week the very next day itself so in the final round that uh, they have it was pretty technical as well as uh, functional part of uh, interview happened so they have given like something uh, scenario based questions asked the one case study they have asked to me uh, it was gone very pretty well so immediately you know, like no they have taken the like, interview in the first morning time and, uh, and next 2 hours like they have given update to us to join the like the teacher come back to me they have been selected and then it was very nice like happy to me like yeah, immediately they have given response to me and then hr was okay telling you join the like you might be gone for the next round like with the chair like they will ask you some questions about your salary expectations and uh, about your when you can able to join the main the main things what if you are immediate joiner that is that is that is that's much more priority to giving the candidate to okay we are giving an immediate joiner i'm giving a three tips for the like now going for the interview before going to the interviews uh, so you might have received a like now kind of call from the hr for the like okay before the next day or like okay two days prior so i could say like to honest first things what yeah, i should make it clear as a, like okay as a candidate perspective i need to get that particular roles and responsibilities and then i should prepare myself to create an entire like the proper case studies should be aligning with your current uh, role and responsibilities as well so which makes much more clear to the hiring manager and also they need to have the kind has to be very clear about uh, something now uh, this need need, need read about uh, also for the company what exactly doing and uh, what is their key uh, road map they should have like little knowledge about that particular background make by because they will ask you like what do you don't know about our culture like, like we are going to uh, why we are going to like join in our company so this is the fix for the three things like has to be known by the candidate the benefits what exactly i get the i could say what is the main uh, the uh, over here tradian like was given uh, as a key, the knowledge as first thing what knowledge perspective second thing is what is very practical things they will give it to us uh, uh, you have to be as a professional career and they will also uh, because what exactly i learned from a tradian like okay, the, they will give there are a lot of kind of practical case studies uh, which makes much more helpful for a professional um career okay like as a as a like for example i'm walking like somewhere else like in the different background they'll teach you like you no know, it's very in the very uh, grass level so that it'll be easy to make to understand what's happening as like what's to be like the product manager role and what is the key challenges and how we're going to cope up with this cope up with this kind of particular challenges what are the solutions they will build the particular to the candidate uh, to the students of the accreditants so in such way that they will not face any kind of challenges while giving an interviews so that is what to say like okay the benefits what exactly i got uh, from the accreditant the beginners what i say uh, the advice could be the first things were to be as practical much more practical to understand the what the problem the triggers what happened if you're giving kind of in a problem statement uh it should come out with the kind of ideas you should be very much clear about your thought process the key objective part so uh then you also you should have a little kind of capable to have a proper communication to whom you are going to communicate so that is also to be understand as a you know, new product beginners they should have a much more kind of do kind of secondary research to get connected with uh, what is the marketing like updating like uh, any tools and technology they have to update themselves